Hey everyone, if you're studying for the NASA CPT exam, then you have probably heard of their Optimum Performance Training Model, the OPC model. It's a big portion of their textbook, and they'll tell you it's a big portion of their exam as well. So something that helped me study and pass the exam was I took all of those important acute variables and made a little chart so I could see everything in front of me, and it all made sense. When you do that, you start to notice the patterns within the model, and you can really fully understand what you're looking at. What I've done for the purpose of this video, I put it all on this board for you so you can see. So one of the examples of the patterns I was talking about, if you look over here, I have all of our levels and phases. So let's take a look at the sets. For level one, it starts with one. Uh, for phase two, two. Phase three, three. Phase four, four. When you get to phase five, it doesn't start with five, but it ends with a five. There's all sorts of little things that you'll pick up on. But these are the big variables that you should definitely know. Um, if you want to take a screenshot, you can do that. If some of this is still not making sense or it's just not clicking for you, send me a message or comment and I can let you know about our weekly Zoom study groups that we have. If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks.